The second season brings plenty of rewards and new events that make the Last War survival game even more thrilling. One of them, and probably the most awaited feature, is the possibility of the hero rarity conversion. In season one, we could convert Mason into a UR hero. This time, in week three of season two, we have the chance to upgrade Violet to UR rarity from SSR. This guide will show you how to do it, compare her before and after stats, and why it is important for your game progress. So why is Violet so special for season two? Well, one of the first reasons why Violet is one of the best SSR heroes in Last War Survival, not just season two, is her third skill, which helps her take less damage from zombies and doom elite giants on the world map. In season two, she offers an extra 5% damage reduction, a frost buff that applies to your entire squad. This is crucial for this event because now all monsters are more difficult to defeat in addition to the VR requirement. Murphy offers the same buff, so if you have both on the same squad, you can get a 10% damage reduction. Her second skill is also impressive. With this skill, Violet attacks two front row units, dealing great physical damage and reducing their attack. And by the way, this applies to both physical and energy damage heroes or monsters. This can be a great opportunity to help your best attackers deal more damage. This skill alone makes Violet a good SSR hero for any type of combat. How to make Violet a UR hero. As mentioned, this feature becomes available in the third week of season two. The requirement is to have Violet already upgraded to five stars and have a legendary hero badge. Speaking of which, you can also use the badge from season one if you haven't upgraded Mason to UR. Otherwise, you get a new badge via the individual goals page of season two after upgrading the high heat furnace to level 30. And here's a useful tip for you. Buy all 30 Violet Shards on Alliance Store from the beginning of Season 2. The store resets every Monday, and 30 Violet Shards will cost you 30,000 Alliance Contribution Points. Unfortunately, I already missed two weeks, so 60 Shards. Otherwise, I could have upgraded Violet to UR now. So how to get Violet Shards? Besides the mentioned Alliance Store method, you can also collect plenty of Violet SSR shards via the individual goals page from almost every new level of your high heat furnace. As you see, you get 10 shards from levels 1 to 19, 20 from levels 21 to 24, and 30 shards from furnace levels 26 to 29. You'll also get Violet shards after each Blizzard event. The rewards can be collected via your mail, and the number of Violet shards depends on the level of the Blizzard. The higher the level, the more shards you'll get. As you see, you got 10 shards from a level four blizzard and five shards after the last level two blizzard. Now let's compare Violet on both rarities and see the differences. A quick disclaimer though, I will showcase Violet's four star purple rarity because this is how far I've upgraded her, but mention the bonuses at five stars as well. So starting with the first skill, we have a physical damage bonus of 200% at four stars and 280% at five stars for the purple version of Violet. On the other hand, the UR version increases this bonus to 491% while the star bonuses remain the same. For the second skill, we see a major difference though. The epic version offers a 400% damage bonus at four stars and it goes up to 514% at five stars and a damage reduction of 6%. For the UR version, Violet has this bonus increased to a stunning 1181% and the damage reduction to 10 seconds. This means you can weaken the opponent's squad for a longer time, maybe enough to win the battle. Again, the star bonuses remain the same on both versions. We also see a new addition to the third skill. While the violet purple version offers a 34% damage reduction bonus from monsters, the UR rarity pushes this buff to 37% and adds an extra 20% for all types of damage. This makes her a better pick for PVP battles, not just PVE. Finally, the fourth skill increases the 10% boost of self HP, attack, and defense of the SSR version to 20% on UR. Plus, the skill cooldown rate is decreased by 10%. So is it worth upgrading Violet to UR rarity? Absolutely. As we can see, her skills get a major boost, which makes her even more valuable in battles and events. I'd like to hear your thoughts on upgrading Violet to UR rarity. Have you already upgraded her or are you planning to do so? Let me know in the comments. And don't forget to check our other guides and tips for Last War Survival Season 2. Thanks for watching.